The other dining facility was a lot smaller than this one. Um, it didn't accommodate as many people, as many like um, soldiers to eat, and it didn't have as much equipment as this. So it was just <laughs> not as good. <laughs> that was. It took us about a day to move everything from over there to here and get this one set up and squared away. We spent a day cleaning, and then next day we got to work. I really don't know. It sounded fun. It sounded fun. Like the job description when I read it, it just sounded like something that I could have fun with, and. It, it has turned out to be a good time, <laughs> for sure. <laughs> any job, any job in the military is gonna hit snags and you just gotta adapt and overcome. Work with it and, you know, make the best of it. I agree. Once they said we had to move, we all came together. We knew that the mission at first was feeding the soldiers. So we all jailed and we came motivated and we just did what we had to do. Everybody got there at a certain time and we worked nonstop until maybe you know, maybe like five o'clock. And before we knew it, everything was done. And we, we didn't know it, it, was, it was that easy. So far, this whole exercise, I got some stars. I got some chefs, I got some pastry chefs, I got some people out here that should be E4, should be E5, uh, E3 should be E4. All of them have done an excellent, marvelous job. Honestly, now, I, I had to chew my own, my own uh, AT. I could have went to Wisconsin, but I chose Arkansas. And I'm glad I did. I'm glad I did. And it's, it takes takes a lot of special care from cooks to make it taste good, make it taste better than just you know coming out of the can. So I'm pretty impressed. Yeah. 
important people.